so we're, we're trying to make a video today. Yep. But hey. it's raining. I don't know if it's raining, but it's lightning. We're in the parking lot. We're trying to go in. We're trying to do the 98 degrees video for you guys, but it's not looking good. Yeah, so currently it's about 6.15. The rain is supposed to be here at 6.30. We are in the parking lot. Do you see how the wind... Ooh, oh, yeah. Do you see how the wind is blowing the umbrella? The thunder is really loud. I hope you got that. Um, but it's thundering, lightning. I don't even know if we're going to be able to see 98 degrees. But we're definitely going to have some food and have some fun no matter what. And guess what? The trams are back at Epcot. Beep beep. <laughs> oh my God, y'all. It is so bad. It started raining hard as hell. It's going to be a monsoon. So make sure you like and subscribe. <laughs> Do all the YouTube things because... We are crazy. Oh <laughs> it wants to take the umbrella from my hand. It does. Look, there's a tram. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. The tram's back, but we're walking inside because we were super late for this concert. <laughs> it already started, right? Yeah, so we're going to try to do the next concert. Oh, my um, gosh. Oh, my gosh. So, stay tuned. Today, we are at Epcot because there are a lot of updates. We are going to ride the Soarin' Over California ride. We're going to have some food and maybe even get to see the 98 Degrees concert. No, we're not. <laughs> it is raining outside. And that's yes. why we're in this building because we want to eat food and uh, we don't want to be rained down. No. We really wanted the nachos. Yeah. But the pavilion that's there is going to be so crowded because it's raining right now. There's no way we're going to be able to eat nachos, even though we want them so bad. Yeah, I really wanted the nachos in Mexico. We're going to try to go down here and try to see what's down here for food. Because every time we come to Soren, we just like look over there and we're like, oh, that looks like good food. And then we're like, never go over there to go see what the food is. So today we're going to take you over there. We're going to let you know what kind of food is available there and let you know if it's good or not. You ready? I'm scared. So we're headed into the seasons. It's a little quick service area here in the land pavilion to be honest with you it has been several years since i've eaten here but we're gonna see what they have of course all of the alcoholic beverages are fully stocked they do have some items in the grab and go section but to be honest it's not anything that's really appetizing it's gonna be like fruit and overnight oats and cheese and fruit salads um that's really it if you look over here all of the stations have already closed for the day so if you're planning a trip keep that in mind i definitely didn't know they closed that early and they do have some stuff for the kids zone that's going to be your water your probably uncrustables let's see yeah your uncrustables some cookies carrots milk nothing really appetizing but there are your grab-and-go prices so I'm over here at the Seasons restaurant and to be honest it looks like most of the desserts are gone but we're gonna see what we can find over here so it really looks like coming to the Seasons was a bust for us but we do have a lightning lane for Soren over California so we're gonna go do that now so from 10 30 to 4 They'll have regular food. After four o'clock, they're not gonna provide any food. It's only gonna be, well, my wife has already showed you, the desserts, the grab and goes, and stuff like that. Yeah. So, we missed that time at four. Yeah. Okay, so since the seasons was a bust for us, we're gonna Ooh. head over. I know, I was really looking forward to showing you guys what's here, 
But I might come back to Epcot later this week because Boys the Men is going to be playing and I need to show you guys Moana's Journey of Water. So it might just be a whole Epcot week. So since we had to make a quick change in plans, we're going to head out and go over to Mexico, have some nachos and go check out the 98 Degrees concert and then come back and do Soren over California. So make sure you stay until the end. So they finally opened up the old Starbucks. It's now called the Swirled Showcase. They have frozen apple pie beverage as well as the cinnamon apple cider. They have alcoholic beverages. They have floats. They have a Mickey shaped liquid nitro cake. What is that about? I don't know. They also have soft serve and a waffle cone. They have vanilla, apple cinnamon, and salted caramel. We definitely have to come back and try that. So as yummy as the Swirled Showcase sounds, we gotta head over to Mexico, have some nachos. The rain has gone away for now. So we're gonna do that, then go see 98 Degrees, and then hopefully do the Soren Over California ride, which is formerly known as just Soren. So I'm excited to see all that stuff and to take you guys along with us, but Hopefully the rain stays away so we can get all this done. The great thing about Epcot right now is all of the food booths are open, including Hawaii. Oh my gosh, we have to come back and try that. The pork slider last year was our favorite. <laughs> so excited to come back and try that. Love that pork slider. Yeah, delicious. So we're getting ready to head into La Catina. The great thing, because of the rain, the line is not long. So we're gonna get those nachos and they are yummy, yummy. Here is a quick look at the menu and everything they have. And we're getting some good old nachos. So we've been coming here for years to get the nachos. They are awesome. So I got the nachos. I got the trio taco. You're gonna share, right? <laughs> if I share mine, will you share yours? Yeah. yeah. The water, enjoy. Thank you. And we also got the cups of water. They are free, yay for us. So we got really lucky. We were able to get a seat under the canopy. Isn't that pretty? Do you see that? It is such a good vibe. But the table is a little dirty. So this is one of my tips to always bring wet ones with you so you can clean off those dirty tables before you have your food. Okay, so this table is really dirty. I'm gonna show you. It's like food and stuff all over the table. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm gonna take my wet one wipe, not sponsored, and I'm just gonna clean off the table. My table was clean and I just gotta sit here and wait with my free water and just wait for my nachos to come. As soon as they get here, I'll show you. They are delicious. So here's a look at where we are sitting. It's a beautiful view and look, our food is here. This is mine, the nachos. And then we got the taco trio. Both look yummy, but these nachos are calling my name. Since the line for the 98 Degrees concert is so long, I'm not even going to try to get like front row or second row. I'm just going to go over there and do the best I can to show you as much as I can. But I'm so excited because my nachos are here and look at the sucker right here. So the nachos are very consistent. They are phenomenal. And William was nice enough to give me one of his tacos. What kind of tacos are these? So this is a taco that I took from William or that he gave me. It looks kind of sad. So I'm going to take some of the toppings from my nachos and dress it up just a little bit. I took some of the beef as well as the tomatoes and jalapeno and dressed it up a little bit. Made it a lot more hearty. So now it's time to try the taco and see if it's good. So after you dress up the taco with the tomato and jalapeno, oh my gosh, it is so good. It's way better than the Pecos Bill tacos. If you watch our channel for a while, you know we try those all the time. But these over here in the Epcot Pavilion, 
delicious. Okay, so we've had our tacos. We've got about less than 10 minutes to head over to the America Pavilion. We're over in the Mexico Pavilion, so I don't know if we're going to make it over there in time, but we're really going to try. You ready? Race is on, man. Let's do this. Let's go. Oh my god, Caramel Kush is calling my name, but we've got to hurry up and get over to the American Pavilion because 98 Degrees is doing their last performance in like five minutes. Y'all, the crowd of people over here watching the concert is crazy. Look at this. This is I Do Cherish You. <laughs> Thankfully, they let us get in the lining lane. 
thankfully they let us get in the lightning lane line even though we were late because the standby line is crazy i didn't even look at the weight but Soaring over California? Yes, it's over California. All of the stuff's over California. It's got more smells, more scents. Uh, I kind of like the other one better. That's just my, my cake. Which one do you like better? Um, I do like the other one better, but this is, you know, I haven't seen this one since I was a kid. The first time I came to Walt Disney World and I fell in love with Disney. So it does bring back some memories of my first and only trip to Disney as a kid. Um, I did remember like going over the golf course. I remember that as a kid. So that was really special to me and kind of nostalgic. So I don't know. So I don't know how long it's staying around, but I'm glad they brought it back um, to celebrate Disney 100. It was really good, a 10 out of 10. That's going to be it for us tonight at Epcot. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. And tomorrow you won't see me. It'll be just my wife. Yep. Tomorrow is the first time I am vlogging by myself. You might see her cry on camera. Make sure you like and subscribe so you can hear that story later. I hope she doesn't. I hope she successfully does her first vlog on her own. I, I am so happy she's actually going to be doing it on her own. I, I have been encouraging her and helping her throughout these years. Years? It's years. It's been like a year already, man. I'm, I'm hoping she's, she's able to, you know, spread her wings and fly on her own. So I'm ready to kick her out of the chicken coop. 
anyway, tomorrow we will be back at Epcot. We are going to do Moana's Journey of Water, fingers crossed, ride some rides, have some food, see 98 degrees, and just have an overall good time. So make sure you like, subscribe, ring that notification bell. See you next time. Bye. Sayonara. I hit my face. You hit your own face? Yeah. Stop being